Hey there, I'm Chaz Tacular, and welcome to American Arcadia. This is a game that came out a couple months ago, and I I am a little bit aware of like what happens kind of in the first act, but uh, other than that, I'm going to be going into this pretty much blind. So uh, let's do this. This, Mr. Walton? This, Comet, is our new project, Arcadia. It looks like a city from outer space. <laughs> Not quite. Arcadia is indeed a city, but it would be built right here in America. Golly. Picture a city of dreams and hopes for the young and old alike, where technology and science go hand in hand with fun and entertainment. Gee, that sounds like a dream, Mr. Walton. Because it is a dream, Comet. And remember, to reach our dreams, we need to soar higher than ever before. All right, let's soar higher than ever before. Are you ready to proceed then? Uh, yes. Yes, I'm ready. Good. We're recording now. So, please, sir, state your name, age, and occupation. Trevor Hills. 28, senior account manager at INAC, although I'm not sure about that anymore. I'm also the most popular person in Arcadia, but you probably already know that, right? Subject 1392, you are entering a restricted area. Stop running and surrender now. Subject 1392. Yeah? You'll have to catch me first, you jerk! <laughs> Man, these guys are terrible shots. Unless they're trying to miss. Yes, we know that, Mr. Hills. Please continue. Uh, I used to have a mundane life. Just my everyday routine, and I, I liked it that way. But... I think it all probably began about two weeks before that dreadful day. All right. 7 a.m. Good morning, Arcadia. <sighs> Today we're enjoying a splendid temperature of 77.1 degrees and a humidity of 53% on this Arcadia. beautiful sunny Friday morning. I need to get some PJs like that. Morning, Kovacs. What do you say? Up for another exquisite cabbage breakfast? Had a boy. Kovacs. Classic Kovacs. Auto droid to full cleaning. Ooh, that's nifty. You know, I really love this '70s aesthetic. I was pretty good at Spectrex when I was a kid, but I'm not into video games anymore. It's not a Steinway, but it fits in my comfy hobbit hole. <laughs> nice. It, what are you doing, robot? Bad robot. Guess that was my robot voice. I don't know what that morning, was. Honestly. Bernstein. Good morning, Trevor. Mr. Bernstein. He doesn't look like a bear. Monorail. Point, and, uh, point over here on your right, station. you can see the Walton Family Memorial. It's a massive sculpture carved in stone of Elijah Walton, uh, his brother Donald, and Vivian Walton, Elijah's granddaughter and the current Arcadia representative. Nobody in this world has a nose. West. Did you notice that? Holy crap, the guy in the poster has a nose! But nobody else has a nose! I don't know what to do with this information. Trevor Hills, welcome to Inax Gemini Towers. You've been working with us for nine years, ten oh, wow. months, and fourteen days. 
Okay, Thank I just, you I just gotta say, I love the the red, orange, yellow stripes on the white background. I just everything about this makes me happy. You're still trying to beat my Spectrex high score, Mitch? It's just a matter of time, Trevor. Just a matter of time. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Hello. Hey, Trevor, are you up for the Blitz Festival party tonight? It's in the Limelight Club. Sorry, no can do. I'm I'm behind schedule. And I'm not much into clubbing either. Think you can have fun by yourselves without the life and soul of the party? Ha! We'll try our best, man. Ada, the automated data analyzer, is the most powerful computer ever built. INAC technology inside. What a workplace. Trevor, my man! Hi, Gus. You look good, buddy. Been going to the gym? Nah, I don't need a gym to keep this ripped body in shape. I also Hills love jeans. all the sideburns. By the way, you going to the Blitz party tonight? Nope, I still have some stuff to finish here. Trevor, man, would it kill you to have a little bit of fun once in a while? Sending the Ada. I do have fun, moderately. I enjoy doing my job. Validated. You won't be enjoying it so much now that Romano is our new supervisor. Sending data? What? Will Romano? Seriously? But that guy's a moron. Um, uh, validated. You know, Gus, sometimes I get the feeling that only absolute jerks, egomaniacs, and obnoxious people thrive in this company. I didn't know you were interested in the supervisor's job. I'm sending it to Ada? Validated. And, I, and I'm not, but... William Romano, man? You gotta be kidding me. Have you ever wanted to leave all your worries behind and have the time of your life while exploring the world and making unforgettable memories? Now, thanks to the Arcadia Edge Travel Grant, you can experience what you've only dared to dream of. Because not everyone who wanders is lost. The Edge Travel ah, Grant R. R. Only in Arcadia. Apply now through ordinary mail or Adenet. Um, uh, Mr. Hills, you haven't really told us anything out of the ordinary so far. Do you really need to go through? I, I know what I've told you might seem irrelevant now, but it'll help you understand later. Trust me. Nine days before that dreadful day. So this takes place in 2023. I guess. Good morning, Arcadia. It's another beautiful day in the city of tomorrow. We're expecting a high of 75 degrees and humidity of 66%. More like the city of yesteryear. Hmm. Good to see you, Mr. Bernstein. Good morning, Trevor. Bernstein Bears. Oh, I hope you are up for a pleasant stroll along Memory Lake. So keep those cameras ready because you might get some really, really nice pics of the Arcadia Spire up there. Next stop, INAC Gemini Tower West. Hmm. I wonder where this guy went. Hey, Millie, have you seen Gus today? Is he sick or? I don't think so. He just left early today. Really? He didn't say anything to me. We're going to fall behind schedule. Man, I'll be working overtime to send all these Ada memos by myself. <laughs> Thank you, Gus. I love that he has a picture of his turtle Kovac. Jesus, this is going to take me forever to finish. I should have been home three hours ago, and I still have a ton of work to do. Tab for CCTV area. Hello. Switch off the lights. Hey, I'm still working here. They're lying to you? Don't be a fool. Six days before that dreadful day. Hmm. Ba, 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 ba. Things ba, ba, be afoot. Ba, ba, ba. Hey, thanks. Ba, ba, ba. What in the world? Ba, 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 ba. What are you so happy about, little robot? Huh? Something strange is going on. My fellow citizens, we have a new Edge Travel Grant winner. His name is... Hey, 
Isn't that Gus? Augustus Rainey, a 31-year-old senior account manager at INAC. Hmm. Soon, Gus will be enjoying Fiji's pristine beaches and crystal clear waters. I hope he packed an Aloha shirt and a pair of sunglasses. Hmm, that's weird. Gus was never interested in any of this. Fishy. So, I barely got to meet him, you know. They promoted me to a supervisor uh, two days later. Gus the Globetrotter left us. <laughs> Romano, I really doubt that Gus ever applied for the travel grant. Ah, uh, you know, Gus, not much of a talker. What a lucky son of a gun, though, huh? Huh? <laughs> Fiji. Ooh, I'd kill for a beach trip right about now. Anyway, uh, make sure that report is ready for tomorrow, will you? I'll be ready, Romano. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to ask you to come in on Saturday. What on earth? Four days before that dreadful day. So it sounds like two different snippets from a song. Or something. Maybe two different snippets from Tether two different hands. songs. Welcome to Inax Gemini Towers. Hey, hey! Did anybody hear that? It's that song again. Nobody? Really? Hmm. That's a beautiful city. Hey, Francis. Morning, Trevor. Listen, Dave, have you noticed some weird things going on lately in the office? Weird? How? What do you mean? I don't know. Lights going off, music suddenly playing in the PA system? No, nothing. Okay, well, yeah, forget it. Hmm. There must be a rational explanation for all this. There must be. The day before that dreadful day. 7 a.m. God, this can't all be a product of my imagination, can it? Hey, Trevor, you up for a couple no, of years no, after... No, 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 I... Sorry, I can't. I can't. What's gotten into him? Leave me alone, damn it. Hmm. What? Jesus. What the? Interesting. Who is doing this? Who on earth is doing this? Would somebody please look at these screens? And nobody else is reacting. No, nobody else. So what? I could just run around and scream like a lunatic? And you guys are not going to pay any attention. Maybe it's only stress. I've been working too much lately. I need to go to the doctor. It's it's been ages since I had a checkup. Yeah, doctor and visit no, might be good. No, I'm not in the mood to play right now. I don't even want to get close to the TV. Not after last time. No, thank you. Who knows what might happen if I turn that droid on? Alright, well, Kovacs is still our buddy, hey, right? Kovacs? Am I going crazy, buddy? Hmm. Ugh. I don't think I'm gonna sleep a wink tonight. Well, you know, tomorrow is that dreadful day. Are you just gonna go to sleep in your clothes? That dreadful day. He did just sleep in his clothes. Those were probably the worst two weeks in my entire life. Or at least the weirdest. Although it was nothing compared to what I was going to experience later that day. Do you know they even had a name for it? You mean a name for your... Yes, that's it. The day the running started. Th you're what? Okay. I, uh, I have to get a hold of myself. 
It's Friday. Just a few more hours of work, and the week will be over. I'll finish here, go back home, have a glass Remember of warm milk, and go to the sleep. Edge Travel Grant too. The only requirements are that you must be of legal age and have an insatiable wanderlust. Request the application form via ordinary mail or Adenet. No, thank you. Hmm. You seem to be really pushing that PG trip. Okay, today's tasks. Nothing like some routine stuff to keep your mind occupied. Looks like they haven't replaced gas. Oh, come on! I didn't even save. Hey guys, did you lose your... What? Gus is... dead. Trevor Hills, please. Your supervisor requires your presence in the meeting room on the 10th floor. Now what? Gus is dead? What in the world? What on earth? Don't be a fool. Something's going on. Something, something, something sneaky. Trevor, ah! listen carefully. I don't have much time. As soon as you enter that meeting room, your supervisor is going to congratulate you for winning the Edge Travel Grant. What? what who, who is this? Just listen. Three travel agents will be there with you to arrange all the paperwork. If you leave with them, you won't ever be seen again. What? What? Wait a second. I, I didn't even apply for the travel grant. Neither did Gus. Follow my instructions when you exit the elevator. It's your only chance to survive. What? what? Wait. What on earth was that? Wow. Here, on the intercom. Look at them. Do those guys look like travel agents to you? Take the elevator at the end of the no. hallway and go straight to the 20th floor. Whatever happens, do not stop until you get there. Oh, hey, hey, Trevor, come here. Okay. I have good news for you. Nope. Nope. You, you won going, the Arcadia Travel oh, no, 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 they've seen me. <laughs> oh, crap. Please, can you come here for a minute? Found with this measure, we will. Hey, you can't be here, mister. This is a private meeting. I'm sorry, I, I'm I just I have, I have to private I, I meeting just, in a giant don't mind me, bye. open office. Cool. Come on, come on. Sorry, couldn't hold it. Take the stairs. Okay, now what do I do? When you reach the twentieth floor, cross the Ada room lobby and enter the supercomputer room. The supercomputer room? I don't have clearance to access the- Don't worry, I'll take care of that. Huh. A little bit of stutter there. Okay. Damn it, there's no exit here. Hey, you strange voice or whatever you are. Can you hear me? What do I do now? Wait in there. I have to do something really quick. What? Calm down. Don't I'll panic. I'll be right back. Oh, I'm so sorry to leave you hanging there, Trevor. What? The admin permissions are updated daily, so I have to do this right here and right now. Great. All checked. Next phase of the plan. There she is. Kendra Tomlin, my inept boss. She's probably been logged into her computer all day, lurking through her assigned citizen grid, enjoying a quiet day with no incidents. Well, that's about to change as soon as I shut down her computer for my cell phone. Which, I don't remember where I put. Ah, uh, where did I leave my cell phone? Wait, so this is- what in the world? This is the first person all of a sudden. I was not expecting this. I have to grant myself admin permissions to help Trevor. Without them, 
I'm afraid I can't do anything to help him. Huh. Comet, the canine cadet. Or as we used to call him in Puerto Rico, Celso, el perro del espacio. Pretty sure that's Spanish for Mickey Mouse. No matter how hard I try, I always have an awkward expression in my ID photos. Huh. A S. 3BF21 stage technician. Interesting. Oh, Jesus, I forgot to call Grandpa for his birthday. Mm. He's gonna be mad. That's unfortunate. Huh. The weather forecast predicts a blizzard for the next three days. Yay! What is. Huh. This little plant managed to survive, despite my black thumb. Engineering and advanced programming books. Some are in English and some are in Spanish. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm such a mess. Someday I'll have to get this huge mountain of paper in order. Digital and deadly. Uh huh. Our pad Kovac signed this postcard for me when I met him at TechCon in 1999. To. Angela? A true... What does that say? A true architect of tomorrow. Huh. Oh, Kovacs! Like the turtle! Science, um, always finds a way. Interesting, interesting. I have to admit that changing the billboards was a bit theatrical, but that's the way I am, I guess. Huh. Okay, okay. So... Okay, I'm looking for a cell phone. Okay, if I was the cell phone of a Latina stage technician, where would I be hiding? Um... Oh. Here you are. There it is. Now I only have to access Kendra's computer and unleash hell. I wrote down her IP here. Oh, how stupid can I be? Oops. Only I could think of writing something that important on my hand. Klutziest activist ever. Yeah, okay, well, we got 190. Uh, that looks like 172. Then two, three, two, and two, three. Sorry for interrupting another hard day of procrastination, Kendra. Just a couple seconds to begin the cursing and screaming in three, two, one, one again, what the? and no. here it is. No, 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 Total no, no. system shutdown. Now, Kendra, you better follow the protocol like a responsible supervisor and call Jean. Yeah, of course, it's Kendra. Yelling? <laughs> you better move your sorry ass to get up here, or you will find out what yelling is. And here it comes, directly from the server room. Jean Wynn, the admin guy. Hey, Jean. Poor Jean, I really owe you one, man. Okay, the server room will be empty as long as Jean is pulling all of Kendra's okay. aggro. What took you so long? And by the looks of it, it's gonna be a while. So next phase, get inside the server room. Can't be you caught on the surveillance cameras. Okay. Cool means. The hallway to the server room is tracked by three surveillance cameras. I need to get close to the cameras and upload the loop footage from my cell phone. But I have to be sure the right video is uploaded to the right camera. Well, if I had to guess, I'd say this is the first one. Ah, here it is. Linking to cam one. Did, did that work? Okay. I had to click the right mouse button to go back. Man, I feel so bad for exposing Jean to Kendra's volatile temper. Okay, so... Bunch of stage technicians in here. I'm sorry, Michael. 
As long as Kendra's in the company, you'll always be the runner-up in the corporate lackey contest. Michael. Okay, interesting. So it looks like their uh, their IDs are probably first name, last name, and then a string of. Oh well, that's all the same. Three BF two one, three BF two one. Okay, so that's probably like the department they work in, I guess. Are you just another Walton Media employee, or are you one hundred percent Walton? Okay, what do we got here? Leslie's office, the third stage technician on the twenty-first floor. Yeah, Leslie. The poster child of order. Okay. Okay. So the Arcadia Dome. The Arcadia Dome is visible from almost every angle of this office. The weather is probably the only nice thing inside. Okay. I mean, I would argue that the aesthetic is pretty nice too. Okay, another camera. Uh, so this. Okay, yeah, that's the uh, the third one. M three, please. Thank you. I'm pretty sure that the board of directors would have gladly erased Kovacs from this picture if they could. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. No, thank you. I've had enough sugar today. Blitz Cola. Taste a moment. Okay. Boasting about being an ass. Par for the course for Vivian. How about a nice big cup of sarcastic comments? I wonder why that's so blurry. Okay, aha, server room. But I still have one more camera to get. Let's see, that's a meeting room. Uh, okay. A complete layout of the 21st floor. Oh, 21! The 21st floor! Yeah! Oh! They, they have different... So, 7NF21. Okay, because these are all... 3BF21. So what is that room? Software room. Okay. Interesting. Well, it looks like the other camera is back over this way. Uh, there it is. And yes, that is cam 2. Is that one? Yes. Is it not going to be suspicious that I've been All walking videos around? All are uploaded and playing the loops. I can enter the server room now. Prior to the loops being turned on. If I could have lunch today with anyone dead or alive, it would definitely be Elijah Walton. Don Walton. What a prick. Vivian Walton. The beloved heiress of the Walton Empire. Ugh. She kind of looks like that rich lady from uh, Snowpiercer. Yeah. Interesting. So, Elijah Walton, good guy. Other Waltons, bad guys. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. What oh, Teresa must be on her cigarette break. Perfect timing. Oh, perfect timing indeed. Floor 21 control. Okay, server room. Let's get in Shit. here. I forgot that Gene still uses the old four digit security system, and I don't know his passcode. Well, there's one way to do this. <sighs> Wrong passcode. Damn it. Nope. <sighs> Wrong passcode. Damn it. <sighs> Wrong passcode. Damn it. Yeah, this might take me a minute. <sighs> Wrong passcode. Damn it. <sighs> Wrong passcode. Damn it. Wrong passcode. Damn it. Okay, there's got to be a better way to find this out. Ooh, what does that say? Um. Right. Ah. <laughs> Look at Maybe this. There. I can't believe it. You're an absolute disaster when it comes to security measures, Gene. But thank God for that. There we go. 
That's two, one, zero, eight. Door open. Boom. Yeah, totally just brute forced that. Um. Okay, what do we got? There's nothing of interest in Jean's computer. The servers are in that room in the back. Okay, that room in the back. Looks to be one room. Okay. So he has an IP address also on a post-it note. Admin permissions. Good. This looks like what I want. Now I only have to access the servers and grant myself admin permissions. Got it. Now back to my office to keep helping Trevor. Okay. Let's go help that mustachioed gentleman. Yeah, so is it not going to be weird that, like, I looped all of the cameras. So the last place they saw me was over there. So maybe I should go over here to unloop the cameras. If that's possible. Can I do that? Because then they would think I was just looking at this window or something. And it's not letting me... Hmm. So I'll just go back to my office. Shit, I almost forgot to restore the surveillance cameras before returning to Trevor. Okay. Yes, all cameras are back to- Hey! Oh, uh, oh. Kendra. You think this is normal? Uh, uh, I, 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 I can explain. Seriously, I have tons of work to worry about, and they expect me to meet my deadlines with constant screw-ups? This is not normal! Oh. Oh. You mean that? Uh, no, no, of course not. That is totally unacceptable. This is the second time I've had the same sudden crash. Remember it also happened a few days ago? Boom. And all my work goes down the drain in an instant. Yes. Hmm. Yes, I remember. Yeah, sure. Uh, definitely Jean has something to do about that issue, of course. Anyway, looks like it's going to take a while. Fancy a latte macchiato at the cafeteria? Uh, sorry, Kendra, I still have some things to finish, and given what happened to you, I don't want to risk losing all my work too, you know? Hi, Vio, I thought she had caught me. Yeah, that's why you gotta keep your cool whenever you think you got caught. Just pretend like everything is normal. Okay, let's get back to Trevor, I guess. Okay, Trevor, I'm back. Oh, thank God. But, wait, you're... Voice is... Oh, forgot to turn the voice modulator on. Ah, damn it. Oops, please. Oh, it's fine. I'd rather listen to a human voice than whatever that was before. <sighs> yeah, what difference does it make now? Anyway, let me open that big door. Like this big door? Cameras are ready. Okay. Great, I can switch between them. Wow, that computer room is really dark. That's not a computer room, Trevor. Go inside, please. Uh, okay. On air. You'll find an earpiece on that table ahead of you. Put it on so we can speak directly. I have the earpiece. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. And you? I can hear you too, yes. Oh, it looks like a TV studio. What is this place? Where am I? And why does it look like the backstage of a TV studio? Because it is, Trevor. This is Arcadia's backstage. What? No, 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 no. This, this, is, this is the Ada room, the most powerful computer ever built. Ada means artifact disposal area. Artifact disposal area? This is where the containers from all INAC employees are dumped to be processed and destroyed. But that... that doesn't make any sense. INAC would lose millions if they just... INAC handles shit because INAC is not a whole company. It's just another one of... Arcadia's intricate lies. But you've had enough lies already, Trevor. Let me show you the truth for once. Yeah, so this is like, uh... Like the Truman Show. Please, Trevor. Have a seat. Now, in its 55th season... American Arcadia. 
A 43 square mile metropolis where each and every citizen enjoys a life of luxury and comfort. Broadcast live 24 hours a day, seven days a week on every digital platform. The most watched media phenomenon on the planet. Arcadia, where a complex system of thousands of cameras registers the everyday lives of their 23,414 Arcadia-born citizens. Experience love, drama, and scandal from all of your favorite Arcadia celebrities. Steve Just, DJ Zoom, Tiffany Amber Gaines, and many more. Vote, comment, and be a part of... American Arcadia. Live from the Arcadia Dome, I'm your host, Vivian Walton. What? What is this? This, Trevor, is your life. A life that has been recorded and compiled right down to the last second. What? Why on earth would anybody be interested in my life? That's exactly the problem, Trevor. Nobody is interested in your life. I'm pretty sure you know who Steve Just is. Well, yeah, everybody knows aerobic Steve. He's... The most popular person in Arcadia? Of course he is. Well, this is Steve Just's track camera view rate. That's the number of people outside Arcadia who watch his life 24-7. And like this people. is your track camera view rate. Actually, you only have one person following your track camera, and that's me. You're not an absolute jerk, an egomaniac, or obnoxious. You're just an average Joe with an ordinary life. Too ordinary. Too ordinary? Too ordinary for what? To be profitable, Trevor. You're not good American Arcadia material. In here, a popular person means sponsorships, media coverage, ads, merchandise. In short, money. And as the audience ratings of American Arcadia are in negative growth, the show can't afford to maintain people like you anymore. Unprofitable citizens need to be... be retired from the show. Re retired You... you mean... Yes, I mean exactly what you're thinking. But... they can't do that, right? They can't kill me, can they? Not legally. But again... Who's gonna miss you if you never ever show up again? Nobody's interested in your life, remember? Oh my god... This... this is a nightmare. This can't be true. Trevor, I know this is tough to swallow, but we have to keep going, okay? Oh. Okay. 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 Okay, okay, okay. Man. That's dark. I, okay, I'm... We can try to use your anonymity to our advantage to get you out of here. But first things first, you have to leave the INAC building and get to the closest monorail station. Like, I knew going into this that it was going to be, like, Truman Show-esque, but that's, that's pretty dark. Okay. Hey, you, whoever you are, I, I don't see a way around here. There is a wardrobe case back there. Bring it here and climb on it to get to that platform. Oh, like this one? Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted. Oh, hold left control to move the case. Okay. So, so the platformer part of this plays a lot like inside. Interesting. Yep. Oops. Bring up the CCTV again. Uh, is that better? Now let's try to find a way out of here. Okay, I need to move that forward, it looks like. There we go. Trevor, are you wheezing? You're in terrible shape, man. Did you get any exercise at all? No, not, not since PE in high school. Because of my metabolism, I don't easily gain weight, so I don't usually do any. Okay, okay. I'm not here to judge your lifestyle or your dietary habits. Just save your breath and keep going, will you? I'm supposed to go up here? Oop. There we 
Here we go. Bring this over. And that's as far as that'll go. Um. Oh, there's another camera. Uh huh. Okay. Bring that out and go right up. There we go. Trevor, hide. No, but he must be around backstage. Oh boy. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's uh that's playing a lot like inside right now. Oh, okay. The platform thingy. Or uh, I don't know what you would call that a wardrobe case. Under the platform. Going up. Um. Okay. I should have put the uh, wardrobe on the platform. Get that back there. There we go. There we go. Crawling through the ventilation. You know, as you do. My oh, wow. fellow citizens, we have a new Edge Travel Grant winner. His name is Trevor Hills, a 28-year-old account manager with no friends and a boring life that nobody gives two shits about. God, you're so mean, Vivian. I'm sorry, I just can't help myself. I know the rules. All grant winners must be publicly announced, blah, blah, blah. But honestly, I don't see the point in it. Who cares about this guy? Anyway, let's take five and we'll record it in one go, okay? I mean, I care. Vivian Walton is a horrible person? I think evil bitch describes her better, but it's that evil bitch who hosts American Arcadia Live feeds every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 8 p.m. Three-hour specials where the Walton Empire's true heiress drags her family legacy through the mud. <laughs> and the audience loves her. So yeah, she's a horrible person. Sorry, mm. ma'am. Dang. Have you seen a guy around here dressed in 70s clothing? Yes, about 20,000 every day. I work in American Arcadia, man. Can't you be a little more specific? Yeah, Caucasian male, fair-haired. Oh, with that description, I can narrow it down to 5,000 individuals, maybe? Six foot tall, mustache, and wears glasses. Have you seen him or not, smartass? Well... The only person that I've seen fitting that description is you. <laughs> what a prick. Okay. Hey, what happened? See what what that do does. I know? Let me fix it. It's working again. Okay, that wasn't very much help. How? How am I supposed to make it across that gap in that much time? Um, I, oh, oh, I can grab this. Okay, okay. I got a plan. Son of a... Go as Fix far it. as I can, and freeze. Could you please give me a hand with this light? Not my job, thank you very much. Go, 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 go. Aha! Beautiful. 
All right. Mannequins? They've put mannequins in here too, just to fill up seats? Yep. Now you're getting it. But why though? Oh, damn it! Trevor, hide quick! Oh, Any crap. news? Not yet, but we've got all the exits covered. Good. He's not gonna get out of this building. Unless he grows a pair of wings. Hmm. Well, they're guarding the elevators. Shit. Plan B, Trevor. Forget about the elevator. You have to find another way out. Me? I'm an account manager. The only things I can find are mistakes and balance sheets. <sighs> Let me think. Um, there's a uh, there's a window in front of you, right? You're not thinking of. We need to get you to the closest monorail station as soon as possible. There's no other option. There's another station literally in front of the Inoc building. Didn't you hear them, Trevor? What part of all exits are covered? Didn't you get? Well, this is a seriously bad idea. Okay. Well. Only way onward is forward. Let's do this. Whoa. Oh god. This is really high. Would you please calm down, Trevor? I shouldn't have gotten out of bed today. In which case you'd already be dead wow. by now. Just don't panic and let me think of something. Uh, uh, uh. Trevor. Yeah, this is really Trevor, giving. All right. Okay, just keep going. Ah. This is really giving me uh, Matrix vibes. Now, there's a lot of uh, a lot of homages going on here. That's it. See, it wasn't that bad. I just realized that Wait, I don't even know your up? name or why you're doing this. I'd rather not give you more details right now, for safety reasons. But you can call me Kovacs. Kovacs? Like, like my turtle? What? No, man. Kovacs, the Hungarian scientists and architects of tomorrow. Science always finds a way and all that, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, our pet Kovacs. I was a huge fan too. I named my turtle after him. Dude, why do you keep bringing your turtle into this conversation? Well, I just thought, yeah, forget it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's Trevor, not helpful. Watch out. Don't let the bargain basement beastie boys see you. The what? Oh, I forgot you don't know the beastie boys. <laughs> the, uh, travel agents. Don't let the travel agents see you. Okay. So okay, looks like I can shutter blocked on INAC Gemini A6 that? R3. Please revert state. Oop. Hexagon, please revert shutter at my location. Thank you. There we go. And they are none the wiser. Hey, Trevor, Keep going I up, say, I guess. You are coping quite well with all this physical stress, despite your age. What do you mean, my age? I'm Twenty-eight. You're. Oh, oh <laughs> you're. Uh, sorry about that. I. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's the mustache. <laughs> you see the guy? Nah. Oh. There's no way he climbed out the window. What do they expect? The stapler guy from office space climbing out of a window. <laughs> Milton. Oh my. How is this? How is this supposed to work? Can I go up like a little? No, 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 no. That's not what I. Oh. Thought it was going to be like an incremental movement. Nah. Oh, there's another expect? camera here. The stapler guy from office space climbing out of a window. Come on. Okay, that shuffled guys around a little bit. Ah, 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 ah. There we go. Woo. That was a close one. Okay. Just now jump what? it. Now what? What? Just jump over the gap and move forward. Are Are you sure? If I miss, I die. Oh come on, Trevor! Even my grandpa could jump that. Oh Mr. crap! Hills, what are you doing? You're going to hurt yourself, Mr. Hills. Oh shit! The travel agents are here. Uh, jump now! Go go go! Uh, 
Hey, that Please wasn't so bad, Trevor. Come on. Stop immediately. Oh crap. That's a bit more of a scary Run. jump. Keep running for God's sake. Come on. Visit Fiji. Visit Tokyo. Visit Paris. Not everyone who wanders is lost. The crane. Yes, trust me. Oh boy. Wait a minute. If he's crap, crap. Uh. What do I do? Send drone to area eight. Ah, crap. Okay, okay. So I gotta move it before he gets on. There we go. There we go. Uh, I'll put that up. Oh crap! I I jumped. Get over that crane, Trevor, quick. Okay. The crane. Yep. Yep. Yes, trust me. Go go go. Okay, move oh, that. No, 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 Okay, okay, there we go. You got a death wish or what? Keep go moving. Max, I'm running out of... Jump as far as you can. All right. Wait, what? you jumped into a swimming pool from the 20th floor of a building? <laughs> Yes, and while I think it's pretty obvious, I'm not exactly a daredevil. Although in hindsight, that jump was nothing compared to what I had to do afterwards. Better already? Dry enough? <laughs> no, <laughs> just skip I'm still it. soaking wet. Sorry about that, but we don't have much time. Get moving before the travel agents get down here. Okay. Door higher than ever before. Oh, that hold me. Yep. Well, oh my! After me. That's gonna be expensive. That was that was almost <laughs> that was almost pretty bad. Okay, come on, Trevor. Keep moving right. I don't will take you where you need to go eventually. That is pretty high up. I love how nobody's like reacting. Keep going, Trevor. You're doing great. Now to this listen, crazy to get to guy. The station, I need you to cross the monorail tracks, right? You were gonna say that, weren't you? I'm afraid so. Okay. Uh, damn it. Okay. Oh, then that wasn't too bad. Nothing like a little bit of Frogger to get the blood pumping. Oh boy. Trevor, watch out. Damn it! Hills got out of the Einak East Tower? How is that possible? He jumped to the pool, man. To the damn pool. H who could expect that? What a screw. In my signal, I want you to haul ass like there's no tomorrow. Uh huh. What's going on? Somebody stop that car alarm. Now, Trevor, run! It's Trevor Hills! Oh, crap. Get him! Rap. Come here, you! <laughs> Running up the escalator. And walking up escalators is pretty fun. I've never ran up one though. Get out of my way! Yeah! In your face! <laughs> what are you gonna do now, huh? Yeah! Look at the face of that bestie kid or whatever you call them. <laughs> bestie kid. No, no, it's not. <laughs> what did I say it wrong? Sorry, I did just, just got a bit overexcited. Ooh. So, where are we headed to, Kovacs? Right into the Cygnus lobby. Cygnus Grand lobby. Hotel Cygnus? What for? There's a badge I need you to retrieve there. A badge? Huh. Interesting. Your holidays in Arcadia are about to begin. Soon you'll be transported to the stunning city of tomorrow. 
But before you have dinner at the top of the Spire restaurant, enjoy the best disco music in the Limelight Club. Or discover the magic of Comet Land. There's something else you need to know. Introducing Access Badge, an amazing electronic device that will allow you to make the most of your Arcadia vacations. Carefully designed to look like a real 1970s prop, your Access Badge will be scanned at the checkpoint terminal on your entry day, and that's it! You don't even need to check in at the front desk. Just use your Access Badge to get into your hotel room and start having fun! Even our auto-droid operated room service will be entirely at your disposal thanks to your access badge. And remember, if you're using the Insta Delivery Service, your bags will be waiting in your room just a few seconds after you open the door. Please carry your access badge with you at all times during your Arcadia visit until the day you leave at your assigned departure checkpoint. Now you are ready to experience the city of tomorrow as Elijah Walton himself envisioned it. Remember, enjoy your stay in Arcadia and do not break the fourth wall. Interesting. So they're like tourists in here. Huh. Uh, well, it's probably time I uh, call it quits for now. Yeah, this is a really interesting game. I'm excited to keep going with it and see what happens next. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, please subscribe if you want to see more, which I definitely will be coming back to this game, so stay tuned. Uh, drop a like below if you like what you saw, and uh, maybe drop a comment. Um, let me know your thoughts on this Truman Show situation. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm... Excited to see where this goes. In case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.